everyone and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here my name is Amy and I am an avid makeup shopper beauty shopper beauty blogger whatever you want to call it but today I have a super exciting video for you guys I have one that has been super super highly requested so I finally got around to filming it and you guys are gonna freak out and go nuts and love it I have decided to film my AliExpress glow kit collection for you today so i'm just going to be reviewing giving you guys swatches showing you closer looks at the palettes that i own i own the five so far so that glow gleam sun dipped moon child and sweets i'm yet to get the newest one on aliexpress it is floating around i just haven't had a chance to pick it up yet so in order i am going to talk about the glow kits plus show you guys kind of a little overview of swatches what the palette looks like that way you guys can kind of decide what palette would suit you best. You don't have to have all of them like I do, but when they're super cheap, like eight to $10, you can't really help yourself to buy them all. And they are honestly amazing for the price, like super, super amazing. You guys will see that in my swatches, but yeah, let's just get onto the review. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up if you did enjoy this video or found it somewhat helpful. Also, just a quick little disclaimer. If you don't like AliExpress products, one, I don't know why you're watching this video, and if you don't approve of the whole China type of makeup, please don't leave any hate. I just delete it anyway. It doesn't bother me. I don't have anything affect my skin. But yeah, always do a swatch test on the back of your hand because you do not know what is in these products before you put them on your face because you might get a reaction. So I always swatch test on the back of my hand when I get anything from AliExpress. I haven't had any face reactions or even any hand reactions so far, but I always have to put that disclaimer out there. So without further ado, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Okay, so the first palette we are gonna look at is the first one I ever got, I believe. It was either this one or that, gl that glow. Yeah, that glow that I got. But this is Gleam, this is like the blue packaging one. Again, I will put over picture and swatches whatnot when I'm talking but in this palette you have hard candy mimosa starburst and crushed pearl these ones are your pinky type of based eyeshadows they are super gorgeous super amazing super creamy the swatches may look powdery for all of these but I promise you guys once they are on your face they are not powdery whatsoever this one is a super pigmented in particular and again I paid eight dollars for them also with my sellers I do not have my sellers anymore I bought these literally ages ago so all I can recommend you guys to do get on Aliexpress just type in glow kit it's that simple heaps come up I just recommend finding ones with like five stars four or five stars and pictures that is how I always find my good buys I will always make sure that they have reviews and pictures so I see what I'm buying before I actually buy it so that is my tip to you guys if you do want a little handy tip on what's good what's bad so that is gleam I loved that one my first ever one I was like what is this and yeah I think I paid around ten dollars for that one at the time next up we have that glow which is this color one it's sort of like a champagne color this one has more of your gold type of tones so this one is more suited to people who do love a gold based highlight this one is in particular like one of my favorite i am obsessed with a gold tone highlight you guys will see in swatches in comparison to gleam to that glow there definitely is a difference in colors so gleam is more targeted to people who do like the pinky type of highlight and that glow is more targeted to people who like more of a golden bronzy type of glow i personally love that glow better than gleam they're all gorgeous but i do have a few favorites so that is all i have to say about that glow but it is stunning and absolutely amazing the next kit i'm going to be talking about to you guys is sun dipped now unfortunately sun dipped is the one that is my dud it is the only dud one that i have the rest are amazing sun dipped is just horrible i think i might have got a bad batch with this sun dipped but you go to swatch it it's not creamy hardly any pigmentation comes off whatsoever when you like even dip your brush let alone finger swatch it so yeah you guys will see in the swatches that my sun dipped palette is not what good whatsoever i am really disappointed that this one was the only dud i mean for this one one out of five is not bad at all i'm not complaining and like i said yeah it's only ten dollars so you can't really complain but i don't know i could try and pick it up again on aliexpress but i don't know if it would be a waste i don't know if i just got a dud batch formula wise but 
yeah, I just would stay away from sun dipped unless you've seen like really amazing swatches. But if you see my swatches, you guys will understand when I say it's not good whatsoever. And you guys know I don't lie to you at all. So you'll see that the other glow kits literally stand over the top of this one. So yeah, I do love the packaging. And this one is targeted to like both skin tones. You get like two, two-ish yellow tones, uh, champagne. You get a bronze highlight and you get a pink one. I wish this was better than what it is, but that is all I have to say about Sun Dipped. You know, you win some, you lose some with AliExpress, and that's what happened with me and that glow kit. Moving on to Moonchild. Now, Moonchild, I'm going to say this, guys. This is probably one of my favorite ones ever. Pigmentation, packaging, it's just all, like, amazing. I can't fault Moonchild whatsoever. Super creamy, colors are gorgeous. I know they aren't your typical normal shades. That someone would go for with a highlight but me I like to experiment and I think these are gorgeous so yeah Moonchild is like my favorite one out of the bunch as well as sweets which now brings me to sweets which is this one here now sweets is gorgeous um I love it I don't know what else to say about it but sweets and Moonchild are definitely my two favorite glow kits pigmented creamy as AliExpress progressed on as the glow kits came out they got better and better so hopefully the new one that comes out is even better than these but these are gorgeous you can't beat the two newest ones like sweets and moonchild but i just love them pan sizes are great huge you get so much product but even if you are just buying it for the packaging it also does look stunning for the packaging but the product in it is amazing too so i would highly recommend Moonchild or Sweets. That is just my personal preference, my two favorites. However, the rest are great too, except Sun Dip in my collection, but that is going to be it. I really hope you guys enjoyed this little review and swatches of the product and whatnot. You guys have been wanting this video and I have been wanting to do it for you. I was going to wait until I did get the new one, but I probably won't get the new one for another like month now. So I didn't really want to wait for this video. So that is why I decided to do that now. Please be sure to give the video a big thumbs up if you did enjoy. Let me know your thoughts down below. Let me know if you guys own any of these and your thoughts. Did you get a better sun dip to me? I don't know. But thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe while you're here. And I will talk to you guys in my next video.